We are treating ourselves. This sailing stuff is easy. I am actually a little nervous. Jenny ain't getting any power. I'm Cindy, and this is Shell. We sold everything and set off on an adventure, living and cruising on a boat named Seashell. Click subscribe and sit back as we show you that it's possible for all of us to live an extraordinary life. Last time, we pulled into the marina at Emerald Bay on Great Exuma in the Bahamas. I felt it was time for a visit with family, so I jumped on a plane and left Shell to fend for himself. After spending a few weeks in Canada, it was now time to leave the snow behind and head back to Shell. are treating ourselves a day at the Sandals Resort. Yay! It's 120 for the day. We're I don't not, know. We're not resort people, but we're just here. Might as well take the opportunity. Yeah. So we'll see how it goes. We'll enjoy it. Yeah. I've never been to a resort. Wow, Sean, this is beautiful. Sandals, Hobie cats. I think this will be our first sail of our life. <laughs> yeah, we may become sailors after this, We've Sheldon. We've only boated for 25 years. Well, longer, it's never, never, too, never too late for that. You don't know what you're going to do in your years to come, Sheldon. Yeah. You really don't. wanted one of these for uh, for fun in Canada. Yeah, I was thinking this was small enough to fit on the bow of the boat. Right? Yeah, this is too big for the bow of the boat. Or we could get another boat. So you got the wind in your sails. Whoa, wow. It's awesome. No engine noise. We're on a beam reach. <laughs> Fuel. I don't understand this. Huh? No fuel. We're not spending any money and we're going for a boat ride. Well, we spent it on the resort. Yeah. So we switch sides. Yeah, turn around. We're turning. We're going to catch the wind in our sails. Yeah. In our sail. Our sandal sail. Wow. This sailing stuff is easy. <laughs> oh, yeah. All you sailing guys. Yeah, right. Uh oh. Ooh. Now we're cruising. <laughs> Sheldon, you look like you're having too much fun. <laughs> Sheldon's getting a catamaran. Great. More boats, the merrier. 
You're keeping the tally craft, though, right? Stay on the vagabond. <laughs> <laughs> Only no kids and no subscribers. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So that was our little sailing adventure. It was fun. It was good. Oh. It's 6 p.m. It's like Cinderella. It's over. Our day is over at Sandals. <laughs> yeah. Well, I feel like we're looking. We're looking at our clocks like 5:50, 5:53. How much longer do we have? Anyways, it's now 5:58. I don't think we've seen it all. Though. No, I don't think we did. Either. No, I don't think we touched the surface. But anyways, that's it. On the golf course this evening, it's just beautiful. That's the moon. Beautiful. Sheldon with our pizza. We got out of the resort with it. We the resort got, wants you to have it because you never rest. ate it at five, so. I guess. Yeah. Today we're going to uh, go diving the first time since we purchased our dive gear. Since we purchased the dive gear. I, and I'm a little nervous there this morning. I'm like, but I got nothing to be nervous about. We're gonna get used to that. Brand new dive gear, Sheldon. Here we go. Our dive gear. Here. Yep. New BCDs. Where's mine? This is mine. Are you nervous, Cindy? No. It's just beautiful. The noise of the ocean. Look so at we'll this. Set up yours first, I guess. I am actually a little nervous. I don't know what, I'm excited and nervous, I guess. You got 3,800 PSI. That's good. Wow, our gear actually works, Sheldon. Yep. Oh man! Should we throw it out in the water? Are you ready to get in? I don't know. I could be. Ready to get in without you? I'll get in and put your jacket on. Okay.
So how'd you like that show? Well, that was our first dive. First dive? It was pretty nice. It was awesome. Yeah. Yeah. We got to learn our buoyancy and some stuff like that. Practice our buoyancy. Practice again. buoyancy, yeah. It, uh, it didn't take long to get used to it. The, the gear was pretty good. Yeah. It didn't feel bad at all. No. It was, and it was a nice reef going between. Yeah. Now we're going to fill up our tanks. Um, yeah, there's a dive shop right there. In uh, sandals. Right? Anyway. It's time to leave Emerald Bay. After an extended stay, Sheldon does a system check to make sure all is working before leaving the dock. We found that the generator wouldn't start. Jenny ain't getting any power. It was an electrical issue that kept us at the dock for another week. When it did start, it blew a belt, so we rented a car to go to Georgetown and get some spares. Yeah, when you come back, I just sat in the knob of that. Open here, my savior. <laughs> belt for the Jenny. Fingers crossed. Before leaving, we hit the beach a couple of more times. Checked out a beach restaurant down the road from the marina called Big Daddy's. Of course, one last visit to our favorite restaurant, Palapa in the Grand Isle Resort. If you don't know already, the Emerald Bay area is the location of that fiasco called Fire Festival. If you haven't seen the documentary on Netflix yet, it's definitely worth the watch. We are really sorry that the local Bohemians had to endure that nightmare. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want more, subscribe and click the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. If you want even more, consider becoming a patron. We'll see everyone in the next episode, and long may your big jib draw.